Before we get into the video, I just want to let you guys know we are doing a Christmas giveaway for an iPhone X. To enter, just subscribe to my channel, turn on channel notifications, then watch this video fully through, and then click the Gleam link down in the description below. Once you click the link down in the description below, you'll be brought to this webpage. All you have to do is follow the simple rules and you can win an iPhone X. Yo, what is going on guys? It is District Training here bringing you guys this brand new video. Now today guys, we're going to be talking about why Tentacion is going to jail. But make sure you guys watch this video fully through because I'm going to be hiding three free Amazon gift card codes for you guys to win it is getting near christmas so i do want to start giving back to my subscribers so just make sure you guys watch this whole video and you could have a chance of winning a free gift card for yourself i'm going to be hiding it pretty well the channel shout out is going to this guy right here on the screen shout out to you man thank you so much for being active on the channel if you yourself watching this video like a channel shout out start on my next video to help you gain a lot of subscribers all you guys have to do is leave a like on the video turn on channel notifications and then comment down below something about xxx tentacion and you'll be entered to win well this is definitely a video that i did not want to make but it seems like today was the day that XXX Tentacion had to go to court for seven new charges that were brought up not too long ago. Now I heard that the court case lasted about two minutes before X was put into handcuffs and sent to jail for these seven charges. Once these charges were brought up, everyone pretty much expected that he would end up going back to jail because there is a domestic violence charge which is automatically whether you did it or not, you're going to be sent to jail. And even whether you did it or not, the court is going to just be frowning upon you because you're not supposed to hit the person you quote unquote love. X was already currently out on bail for totally different case so he wasn't really that liked by the court too much anyway but everyone with a brain definitely knew that he would definitely be going back to jail for this it's just really sad because he was a, he's actually a really good person at the end of the video i'm going to be showing you guys some clips of x when he's in his best motivational moments and stuff like that i highly recommend you guys watch that especially if you're not really you know a fan of x i definitely recommend you watch it but sometimes his emotions do get to him for things but i guess you got to pay the consequences for your actions and that's what x is going to be doing for a pretty long time time now at this time we currently don't know how long he'll be locked up for but if you guys want my best guess i would say around six months to a year now we all know he recently just got signed to a six million dollar deal with capitol records which is actually a really good thing because once the court charged him with these seven new charges I could imagine Capitol Records definitely would have told him to make some music quickly because they did just literally only like about a month ago give him the six million dollars and they most likely wouldn't want him locked up with no music. So I can imagine he made a lot of music while he was awaiting court. So if I had to guess there's going to be some new music out by X within a few months. I'd imagine he's going to be spreading out all the music Well, you know like he'll drop like a new song every month or so just depending on how long he's going to be incarcerated for. He also did just release the Christmas mixtape a couple days ago and he said on Instagram that he recorded and produced all the songs literally only in a day. So I can imagine he has a lot of music ready for you guys. Now obviously no one wants him to go to jail but X is actually really positive about this situation and I kind of have a theory on why. I have no idea if this is true but when an artist is locked up their music tends to just blow up a lot more than when they're not just for an example look at Tay K or even X his song look at me started blowing up like crazy when he was locked up and that's kind of what started off his career so in all honesty this could actually help his career in a way if you guys kind of think about it but nobody really wants him to be locked up anyway because everyone in you know does deserve their freedom unless you did something like really bad then I hope you are locked up but there's no actual proof that X did this because when his so-called ex-girlfriend did get quote unquote beat up he was actually in jail when it happened so we're honestly not even 100% sure what the real story is but I really do want to hear your guys' comments on this video so make sure you guys leave a comment down below anything about XXX and Tassian I'll be sure to reply and guys we're getting so close to 100,000 subscribers so if you can please subscribe to the channel tell a friend to come subscribe tell your friend like family members to subscribe anything really that would honestly help so much I'm gonna be playing some clips of X's best motivational moments I really highly re recommend you guys watch this because this could also just be the last time you see of X for a little while so i really recommend you guys do watch this if you guys do enjoy as i said make sure you guys leave a like enjoy this clip and if, and if, if it's not accordingly then how are we living how are you living if, it, if if your life is not just like i'm in control of my life and everybody and everybody supports me i want to teach everybody to do what the i'm doing and if i'm not doing that then i'm a fake if I'm not teaching people how to make money, if I'm not teaching people how to love themselves, and I'm not teaching people how to do everything they want to do with their life, then who the f*** am I? I'm not your f I'm, If I'm not teaching you how to do better with your life, I'm not your brother or your friend. I'm a f***. Hey, hold on silence, please. <laughs> Listen, I want to say something to you guys. Check out, see that? Alright, so listen. No matter what anybody tells you, each and every individual in here is a star. All of you are here. Listen, 
Life is going to be very fucking hard. Nothing, nothing comes without sacrifice and nothing comes without pain. You make sure, listen, you make sure no matter what the life throws at you, you never get the up. You hear me? I don't know what each and every individual's dream is, but if you believe in yourself and you take heed to what you believe in, you can accomplish it. Gonna, I'm just gonna ask questions, talk to you guys about life, period, nothing, I mean, out of the way, you know what I'm saying? So the first thing I'd like to do is go around and probably ask what your dreams are, each individual. So, what's your dream? Be an NFL player. What are your main influences in music right now? I, I'm telling you as a man, I could never go through anything that you just told me. I, I tell my mom every day that if I lose her, I, I'm, done, I'm done. Give me a situation to where in the past week that was extremely discouraging for you. I can go tell, I can go tell her and her she's beautiful in the day, and they go home with no job or no funding to feed their family. But what we can do for them is present them opportunity. But like I said, it's not about what's thrown at you. It's about how you deal with it. And everything is constantly a level up. The whole process from birth until now is to evolve, whether it be physically or mentally. But you cannot evolve physically and not evolve mentally, because that tells a story in itself. You know what I'm saying? Video. All right, this one, fit, this one fits you. For like, this is my secret channel. My shirt, medium, is for you. And then my boy has a, a brand. I mean, I was giving away this shirt, but I was like, whatever, I'll well give it to you. You know what I'm saying? Bro, give him this one. Right. Hold the camera. Appreciate you. And this is my boy's brand right here. He actually has a brand. It's called Writer. That's me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, that's shit hard. Yeah. I like that. Yo, this one hard. Hey, that boy likes your shirt. Yeah, that's all you. That's all you. That's all for you, dog. I appreciate you. I like that. W on the back. Yeah, I might promote this shit, bro. Yeah, that's yeah, all you, bro. I appreciate hey, you, I'm, dude, I'm, yo. All right, man. Hey, yo, I appreciate the effort, though, bro. Huh? Real man, shit. Thanks, bro. You take it serious. No, bro. I do. I have... this, this type of shit is gonna take you far. Keep following. Thanks, dreams, bro. I appreciate bro. it. It goes, it goes very far, and then just even <laughs> don't get caught up in everything that's outside of your mind. The more time you spend with your mind, <laughs> I really want you. To, I really honestly want you to keep on learning because if you know, it doesn't go anywhere. Okay. Everything besides what you got planned does not matter. Okay. You gotta stay in your mind. Exactly. Keep going, man. Hey man, I appreciate so much, dog. That's me and you. Study your laws of the universe. Laws of the universe. You get the master key. I'll be here, dog. Because I would have never thought I would ever go through a situation and that something would ever affect me the way I never thought I would feel something for someone I barely knew. Up so bad just because I st I came from it and I could there's no way it it just sucks when it gets to a point to where there's no way to to change what happened there's no way for me to bring this girl back there's no way for me to remotely it it just sucks when it gets to the point to where you can't do anything so again if you have any friends or family that are showing signs of depression, you make sure you support them and you are there for them. And you make sure you do what you gotta do to support them. Rest in peace, Jocelyn. My condolences to her family. Right now, I feel as if you all, I don't, I don't know, I don't know. What do you think about going to college or university? If you want to be a doctor, if you want to be a lawyer, if you want to be anything that requires school, you go to school, take yourself to school. If you need anything, if it requires school, take yourself to school. I do not shun school. I will not say if I ever get ignorant and playing around. Some people need school. I'm not about telling kids to drop out of school because if you want to be, look, my, my plan A and my plan B is this. Look, when I, when I came up, when I, like, when, I, when I grew up, my main things were this. I either wanted to be a UFC fighter, I wanted to be a football player, or I wanted to be a rapper. Those are the only three things that apply to me. None of those require school. None of them. None of them require school. None of them. So 
That's why I dropped out. That's because I knew what my dreams were. I didn't let the world manipulate what I wanted to do and, and make me procrastinate. Because what 